What's up people? New region, new level cap and of course the new gear. I've already done the video for accessories, showcase, and now it's time for the weapons. Guys, we have additional 35 weapons. Yes, they are tier 2. A lot of people mention it tier 3, but it's not a tier 3. It's the tier 2 weapons and there is a tier 2 arc boss weapon. Before that we had the normal tier 2 weapons and tier 1 arc boss weapon. Now it's changed. Guys, I will make the video for the sets i mean the gear sets also and after this everything i will make the video is these weapons are good is this gear is the good is these accessories are good how you can compare them how you can mix them to make your best set so if you don't want to miss those videos you have to subscribe the channel also guys now i will show you the translated versions of the passives you know in the game there is the korean version of the items there is a description of the passive skills as the korean i've made a translate for him it and enjoy but before that i want you guys ask you to subscribe my channel right now at this moment i play this game on the korean region i have a lot of knowledge about throne and liberty i'm making the guidelines which helps you so much once we get this game on the global market so hit the subscribe button and if you will like the video don't forget to hit the like button too okay now let's get back and watch the video I'm so excited with these new weapons. There is a lot of variation what I'm checking. If in the past you were sacrificed some stats to gain some things which you wanted for your build, now you have a lot of choices. And I have to realize, I have to analyze this every changes and I will make my own build as a staff dugget. If you don't want to miss those builds and the future upcoming guidelines for Throne and Liberty, you have to subscribe the channel. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. As always guys, see you in the next video.